Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to the first episode of Potion Craft. We do have a tutorial episode before this one in the playlist. If you want to go check it out, you're welcome to. Uh, but it'll probably be unlisted pretty soon if it isn't already. Uh, we're going to jump into this as though we've done the tutorial, which we have. I'll cover some bits and pieces of the basics while we go. But uh, other than that, we're just going to continue on. And this is the first series that we've got, or the first episode that we've got, that doesn't have a timestamp in the episode. Isn't that crazy? Anyway. Uh, but yeah, so. We've just woken up. The beginning of day two. We have all of our basics. We have all of our objectives. And that is what we're going to do. Uh, now, apologies if I am a bit croaky, or if I suddenly have to clear my throat or anything like that. Because I am... Um, bit under the weather at the moment. Not doing all that crash hot. <clears throat> but I will get there. Gonna collect all of our ingredients from the garden. We can turn them into potions. We'll have our first customer and just check them out. I need a potion that can get rid of cockroaches, bed bugs, and other insects. Now I'm gonna assume I'm gonna assume that he wants a potion of poisoning. I'm gonna brew one. And we'll see if he wants that. Now we're just starting in the shop side of things. You can just you can sell them for the the thing that's here, or you can haggle. Right? So if we just sell it straight up, boom. He loves it. Good afternoon. Yesterday at a friend's party I burnt my tongue on some hot soup. Now I can't taste a thing, and I'm a brewer. I need to be able to check the quality of my product. My tongue is useless now. Do you have a healing tincture of some kind? Nah, sorry, we sell potions, not tinctures. What do you think this is? A t tincture shop? Um, I'm not going to have um, much voice. So, we'll just sell him a tincture. It's fine. But as far as haggling is concerned, right? So, we can pick normal. Get two extra gold if we succeed. Plus three, but if we fail, we lose one. Or plus four, and if we fail, we lose two. I'm just going to stick to the easy one until I get the hang of it. Now, I have... Oops. I have um, played this once before, or quite a while ago. Didn't get too far into it, but I have played it once before. Greetings. I recently went fishing at a lake in the forest. I cast my line out and immediately got a bite. I reeled it in, tried to get it off the hook, but that fish had some teeth, and it bit me on the palm and then flopped back into the water. Now my hand is all swollen. How can I fish? Well make your healing potion, mate. That's pretty pretty straightforward stuff. Alright. So we got a couple of recipes in our book, which we did through the tutorial. We saved poison and healing. Real simple potions. I'll show you how to brew potions in a minute, because we're going to have to. And you'll, you'll realise that there's a lot to do as far as potions are concerned. Um, because by this point, we've kind of already got the shop up and running, so while we're here doing this, um, how's his medium look? His medium looks alright. Back the other way. It's just a timing thing. Your shop has become more popular. Hey, reach popularity of two. That's good stuff. Um, new alchemist. I'm the local herbalist. I gather plants and sell them. Want to see what I have for sale? I think I have something that might interest you. You sell anything besides herbs? I only sell what I know about. Flowers, herbs, roots, and various berries and fruit. You can buy other things from other merchants. Oh, she does sell roots. And berries? And other things? Now, I believe... So this is our skill tree. I believe... Affects trans transactions with merchants and potion sales to customers. Okay, so we're just going to dump a few points into this, right? Because then that way her prices hopefully will be cheaper. I don't know if they'll reset or not, but we'll, uh, we'll see. Shasha Goods. All right, so she's got some stuff here. These are just standard price stuff. Pretty normal. These ones are on discount, right? Which is good. Uh, is there anything that she has here that we don't have? So we got a bit of that, a bit of that, a bit of that, a bit of that. We don't have much of this. 
That's alright. I'll buy some of the cheaper ones. Get some cheap stuff. <coughs> Um, let's get a bunch. Actually, oh, there's going to be the occasional big cough that I need to try and mute for, and sometimes I'm going to miss. All right, let's um, let's just spend a bunch of money on this, but we can haggle her down. So, how much have we got? We got 140. I might grab one of them as well. Why not? Let's haggle. See, it looks about the same, eh? What are we currently at? What are we, what are we at the moment? 160. We owe 160, but if we fail, she's going to take everything. So... Don't know what to start with in a conversation. Talk about the weather. Yep. All right. Let's let's try this one. That's it. I had to back out because you can you can basically uh, bank any sort of. Uh, deal or whatever you've got if you bail out on either end. Yep. Ten bucks off is still good. And that is the end of the dialogue with her. Ooh, twins. Kind of. No, one's dark hair, one's light hair. My head really hurts and it's keeping me awake. Do you have kind of sleeping draft that can help me? What if instead of a sleeping draft I give you a healing tincture? I'm just going to see if I can give him a healing tincture. Because you might take that instead. He'll take it. Take it. Not what he wanted, but he'll take it. Better to deal with the problem than the symptoms, you know? I need a potion that will help me quickly start a fire in the fireplace. Alright, so we're going to get potion making. So in the tutorial, we learned how to make poisons and healing drafts. And now... Now we're going to make... Something fire based. So you pick an ingredient, you can see the paths that they add. We want something that goes left. We don't have a ton of things that go left, but we can take this, grind it up in our mortar. Alright, chuck it in the cauldron. We'll give it a stir and get over in that direction. Alright, let's try um let's try another one. Grind it all up so it gets the full length of the thing. Chuck it on in. So I feel like it's going to be worth... Let's grind this so that we can get sort of in that general area. About there. All right. And then we'll stir it up. We should be right in it. Ooh, it's a level two potion as well. That's that's great. Um, all right, let's cook it up. Yeah, fire potion, sick. Which is exactly what he wanted. Le flamme. This potion will do, but I'll pay more for something of higher grade. Why did you pay more for this one? Talk to him about reading. Seventy-one gold. Hell yeah. You're kicked by a horse. One of your ribs is broken. Maybe two or even three. Can you help me? Damn. You should probably see a doctor if bones are broken. But I could do this for you. As I sound. That sound good. Joy. Alright. So this is all busted up. We can't really do anything with this for now. And I never got far enough to actually do anything with that either. Uh, what stuff have we got left in our book to do? 
cross everything off. <clears throat> Create a potion of frost, hey? All right. We could probably do that today. So. Is that our best ingredient for that? Hold on. We'll get our compass stuff, right? Let's go with this one. Grind it all up. I've got a feeling it's going to be in... I'm pretty sure it's off to the right. I think you have like a potion to the right and a potion to the left. Those little books that we're collecting are XP. You get XP for doing like new potions and stuff, but you also, and then like crossing stuff off that list, but you also get XP for collecting these little books around the place. Even if it's not necessarily on the, the straightest path to get there. I'm not worried about getting it perfect at the moment. Just cheap and easy. We've created a potion of frost. And then the last thing is to start a new day. So let's start a new day. We'll start day three. I'm going to have a sip of my drink while it changes so that I can keep talking. Alchemist's Path Chapter 1 has been completed. Good job. You completed the chapter. With each new chapter, new visitors, order types, potion bases, merchants, and purchasable items appear. Continue to complete the goals in the Alchemist's Path to unlock the full potential of your alchemy equipment and learn all the secrets of the trade. So we'll go harvest some stuff from our magical garden. Get some more ingredients and bits and pieces. Rarer bits and pieces, some nice stuff. And we'll see who's coming into the shop today. I need a potion that I can throw that deals damage. I've got a feeling a fire potion might do that job. Some some Le Flamme. What do you reckon, bud? Bring some fire potion will do the job. Yeah. Um I'll just sell it to you. Oh actually we should uh, also level up too. I'm just going to dump, like, so this one, additional bonuses appear on the alchemy map that give you experience when collected. These bonuses appear in random locations and are updated every day, so there's just extra books around the place when you're brewing potions. It's good, but I think early on we don't really need it. Um, increase your visibility radius on the alchemy map, allowing you to explore new areas faster. That, I think, will be handy, but not yet. I think I'm just going to put points into trading and just get a bunch of points in trading to start with so we can just get as much money as possible and buy a bunch of ingredients and whatever else we might need. I think it'll work. Hello, Robert. Welcome, welcome. Is this another new game you've started? Yeah, technically, yeah. But I don't have much voice today, so I wanted to do something chill. Um... I had some strange soup for lunch today and now I don't feel so good. Do you have anything for a troubled gut? No more gastronomic adventures. I'll pay extra for a truly strong potion. Okay. So we could work on a truly strong potion for this guy. My potions are too strong for you. You can't handle my potions. Alright, let's try this. Try this. Hopefully not. Um, ruin a bunch of ingredients. Alright, now this one, it looks like it goes right through it. I'm going to grind it all the way out, even though I don't have to. And what I'm going to do, I'm just going to stir it real slow, because if we can get like a tier 3 health potion, then that's going to be grouse. So one. All right, so with that there, all right, 
right, if we go just like a pixel further. Okay. And now we can add this to it, a little bit of water. Bring it back towards the center. There we go. That is a tier three right there. Now let's change the bottle shape. We'll make it... Make it a... Uh, we have a heart shaped bottle? Come on. Am I blind? is I just can't see it but we'll make it a uh... make it a big one like this Hard on it. Whoa. That's a lot of stickers. Healing. Oh, he can rotate it. Can I not rotate it? Okay. What are we going to call it? Um. should pay good money for this one. Excellent, the potion is perfect. Yeah, it is. Now, haggle. Mm, I don't like that one. There we go. Easy peasy. Hope that gut gets better for you, mate. My husband is going into the woods to track game. He could use a potion to help him hunt better. Oh, shit. Uh... Hmm. Potion to help him hunt better. Mm. Potion of explosion, wild growth, strength, dexterity, swiftness. Um... I'll be right back. Help him hunt better. It's gonna help him hunt better. Thank you for the good stuff, Robert. I do need it today. I suppose we go exploring north. <coughs> Hold on, what have I got a lot of? Let's try this just for a second. Now right, grind this up. Sick or just strain your voice? Sick. Sick at the moment. I have cold. We have 23 ingredients. What if I go... No. Uh, okay, interesting. This one goes that way. Is the good stuff now just tea and honey? No, no, no. Just, just soothing drink. Not tea and honey, no. I'm not a fan. But it's good for you. Yeah, I know. But if it tastes like shit, I'm not interested. Can't watch this. It reminds me too much of work. That's alright. 
Go on something else. You are not, uh, your contract does not bind you. <clears throat> Kidding, but it does remind you of your job. Ah. So you know how to win then, is what you're saying. next to us does. I should really order my, my stuff. That's the only one that's going to take us right. You probably speed run the game in 15 minutes. Totally, I believe you. Probably about as good as we're gonna get here. Oh, that could work. I mean, the hunter could use swiftness, you know. How about a swiftness potion? Yeah, she likes it. Do I need any herbs? Fucking earth, I do. I get more trading. Who else do you sell herbs to? Who else do you sell sell your roots to? Herb lady. A lot of people need herbs in town. Some of them use them as seasoning, others for medicinal purposes. And the brewer is often using them to brew new kinds of beer. Oh, I see. Show us your goods. Really? That's what you've got on you today? That's shit house. That's that's pass. Um, nah, piss off. You want to be agile as a lynx. Do I have a potion that can make you as agile as a lynx? Maybe. Is that Geralt behind you? His name's Geralt. Not Geralt. Potion of speed is not a potion of agility. There you go. Um, maybe. I'll go. I'll do an experiment. Hey, let's go south. I guess. This one goes real south. I'll just use this one for now because I've got a lot of it. Good stir. Okay, a second one. Whoops! Put a second one in the bedroom, apparently. You need some herbs for the bedroom. We've got what you need right here. Alright, um. I guess I'll go a third one. Alright, what is it? What do you got for me? That's strength. I mean, I'll save the recipe, but that's not what I needed. Okay, um... What if I go... I go very west. Uh, east. I know the difference. It's because it's upside down. 
I'm in the Northern Hemisphere. It's all backwards. I like that the mortar's kind of like... Blunk. It's physics-based. You can finish with it standing up. Like, it'll plonk wherever it plonks, you know? I love how it like properly crushes up and stuff. Ooh. Go north. Let's go north. Should have done that because I don't want to overshoot. No, I'm not going to get a two out of it. There's dexterity. How's that? You're going to pay very much. Fucking oath, you're going to pay pay a whole bunch. You like music? I like music. Hello, Geralt. Geralt. His name's Geralt. Alright. Hello, Alchemist. Oh, I shouldn't do that right now. Anyway, help me replenish my supply of potions. I had some with me, but the hunt turned out wild. Ha! Ah, get it? It was a wild hunt. Ha! And I had to drink every last one. I need the potion that accelerates wound healing, preferably not very toxic. You a hunter? Right, but I don't hunt animals. I hunt creatures like trolls, ogres, and various ghouls, sometimes harpies. In general, I deal with all kinds of fantastic game, but the pay's decent. Oh, that's good. Um, accelerates wound healing, eh? Uh, what if I give you, like, a really fucking good wound healing one? You get decent pay, then you, you, you pay decently for it, right? There you go. No, nah, not really. Okay, cool. This potion is perfect. You know what, Geralt? For you, you just have it. It's Geralt. <clears throat> Whatever. Alchemist, give me a healing potion. A bandit shot me through the shoulder with an arrow yesterday. The wound isn't serious, but I can't lie around for a whole month. I need to get back to work. Okay. Uh. One of them and one of them. I'll give you, I'll give you one of the shit ones, mate. See, it doesn't look that much worse than that one. They start to panic. Once they screw up once, they screw up all of them. You can just put these anywhere. To him, it's like Elden Ring with panic rolls. Yep, exactly right. Alright, um... 
I need a potion with two different effects. Popularity level of four, which isn't going to happen today. Explosion and wild growth, eh? Alright. Um... Let's... I didn't go through that portal, did I? Oops. We... Let's say we continue from here. And then... Could kill me. I might die. That's really the only other option that we've got. Oh, we made it. We do a little bit of brewing in here. Are you fucking kidding me? Whatever. That'll do. Dexterity and cold. Let's call it a day. A new day begins. Yeah, it does. Alright, head out to the garden. Pick all our plants. Ooh, we got some mushies on the tree. What are you buying? Oh, your, your shop. Okay. I see you recently opened. I'm also an alchemist, but I'm just passing through town. I'm collecting some ingredients and selling some alchemy equipment, so I decided to drop in. I'm running light right now, and only have enchanted paper with me. But if you need to expand your recipe book, you can buy a couple of sheets. Enchanted paper? The sheets in the recipe book are made of special enchanted paper. The enchantment slows down the paper's aging and allows you to edit existing recipes. You can even completely erase an old recipe and write a new one instead. In addition, sheets of enchanted paper can be conveniently bound into the recipe book, allowing you to expand it almost indefinitely. Oh, okay. Which, what, what, what are they? How price? Ooh, good price. Good price. Um, yeah, okay, hold on. Alright, let's, um... I have six pages, thanks. Especially since they're on special. Oh. And the medium haggling, it looks pretty fucking easy too. Yeah. It's a deal. Hell yeah. Thanks, Might. Okay. Do we have enough? No, we don't. Okay. I urgently need to bring something to the next village over, but my horse is not particularly fast. I'm afraid I won't make it in time. Do you have any potion for horses? To make them faster or give them more endurance? I heard that this kind of potion comes out best if you had more of these ingredients. Cloud crystal. I'll pay extra if the potion is made from them. What the fuck are you talking about, cloud crystal? Get out of here. Get out of here with your cloud crystal bullshit. I don't know what you mean. Have that. Deal with it. Hey, Alchemist, I need a potion. Something that will be useful in a fight. Do you have anything? Uh... Yeah? A potion of strength right here? Oh, yours. It's nice to see a new face in these parts. I suppose you're a new alchemist. Wonderful. 
I'm the local mushroomer. That's a job. All right. Loves fungi. I know someone else that loves fungi. If you're an alchemist, then you must know the quality ingredients when you see them. I have a few mushrooms here. Will you take a look? Do you sell anything other than mushrooms? Nope, just mushrooms. Not good enough for you? Fuck off. All right, show me goods. These are discounted. Dryad saddle. Stink shrooms. Sulfur shelf. Mad mushroom. They're the penis shrooms. Um. I don't know how useful these ones are going to be. They're on the cheap. I'll buy one of them. And, um... Grab a couple of them. Grab a couple of them. Grab a couple of them. Why not? A couple of everything. <coughs> I'm gonna haggle the shit out of you. I didn't mean to do that, but that's alright. Alright, cheers bud. Get out of my shop. I need a strong and fast-acting poison. I'd appreciate it if you saved your questions and kept our deal secret. Your silence will be rewarded generously. Oh. I mean, I'm not one to ask questions. Maybe you need to deal with rats or something. That's not really my problem, is it? There you go, bud. I will charge you a lot, though. You know, my discretion doesn't come for free. There you go. Oh, I lost goodness. Okay. I was working in the fields recently and found a strange chest buried in the ground. I think it's treasure, but there's a cast. The chest doesn't have a keyhole. How can I open it? Ooh. Um. Strength? Or explosive, maybe? Uh. She says she'll pay more for the best one, but I'm not going to do that. Can you break it open with strength? No. Nope. Okay, I'm sorry. I'll just... I'll leave this here. So you want an explosive one, I'm assuming. Alright. So I'm going to go... Up this way. See if I can come across it. Let's grind up some penis shrooms. Nope. not doing great. Alright. We're out of the penis room, so we need to adapt. Uh, we are unable to adapt. Might be able to adapt. Hold on. No grinding. Ah, fuck yeah. No, put it back.
Gonna do this one. We gotta grind it up real good. This is not an efficient way to get to where I'm going. Right. I'll add a bit of water and at least make a two out of it. Come on. Yeah, it's not going to be a three. Unless I add one of my rarer things to it, and I don't really want to do that. Explosion! I'll save the recipe, but it's not a good recipe. Okay. I have a potion for you. Should do the job, hopefully it won't explode the whole fucking chest, but... money. My throat's been sore for a few days. Do you have any medicine that'll help? Oh, mate. You're preaching to the choir. Got something real good for you. Man after my own heart, hey? I'll even sell it to you just for the 36 it's worth. All yours. Buckaroo. So I don't have three points. I need three points for the next rank in that. Need a potion of wild growth. See, I noticed something too. The diagonal, like it's showing me. I'm assuming that the bottom right is wild growth. So what I might do, I might try and go down towards the wild growth now. Um, yeah, continue from here. Well, keep on stirring. Because at the very least, then this will be the potion of, of super duper healing, you know? Stop that. Right, not some more of my rare ingredient. Well, it's not rare, but it's not as common as some of the other stuff, you know? Ooh, do we go through the portal and possibly end up somewhere dumb? I don't think we do. Let's, um... Another one, I guess. It's a lovely noise. Oh, there's something. Hmm. That might be it, too. Uh. I don't have any up and right. I have any just go right ones? I do. Okay. So, I'm going to chuck in one of these. Nope, just straight on in. And then... I could have finished it off there, but that's alright.
Just a gentle bit of water. At the very least, I want to bring it back to a two. Wild growth. There it is. Good job, you completed the chapter. New stuff, yay. Alright, we'll put a fancy one out here. Got another point too, so I can actually get the next point in haggling. Well, not haggling, trading. And the next page of the book. Reach popularity of five, potion of three effects, repair the alchemy machine, potion of lightning, potion of mana, potion of stone skins, potion of sleep, potion of light. Okay. Mmm. <coughs> Sipping of drinks. New day begins. Nice little selection of plants. Is that something new, was it? This one. Weird shroom. Okay. Cool. Who's here? Greetings, I'm a wandering merchant. I was passing a shop and decided to stop in. I think you might like some of my goods. And I don't mind buying some of yours. Shall we trade? What do you sell? I don't specialize in anything. I travel around buying and selling. Okay, so he's just like your miscellaneous vendor. Your random vendor. Ooh. Ooh, he's got some stuff. Wow, so the enchanted paper that I got from my old mate for 75. That's cheap. Damn. Alright. Ooh, what's this? Thunder thistle, eh? Hey? Okay. Tangleweed? Hmm. Oh, witch mushroom. That's that looks actually really handy. Costs a bit. Let's grab a couple of them. Let's grab one of them, since he's only got the one anyway. Um, um I don't like Dryad Saddle. Grab some Tangleweed. Um, I think I'll probably grab a couple of them. four of them, we'll just try and haggle him down, eh? Oof. That seems harder. Oh, beautiful. Smashed him. Thanks, bud. Get out of my shop. Hello, wizard. Uh, I want to charge my staff with the power of lightning. Do you happen to have a potion to work? No. But I could probably make one. I reckon lightning's probably like... Sky and water? Maybe? It's probably like northwest. I'm gonna take some of these thunder set thistles and just assume that it's a hint. Can we stop being up the top there, please, cursor? Alright. 
use another one. I don't know how far up that's going to go, but... Hopefully it's not too close to the skulls and stuff. Ooh, there's a potion to our right. Let's go that way. Because it's basically in line, right? Oh, that's not what I wanted. Yeah, there we go. And now, I can just add water, bring it back. It's probably a little bit too high, isn't it? Bah. Oh well, close enough. Not even the potion that I wanted. Damn it. Okay. What if... We just keep going in that direction? What are you doing? Also, can I delete this one? This one needs to go. I don't have any more thunder thistle. Damn it. Alright, well. I don't have enough thunder thistle, I mean. Okay, well, let's do it the long way then. No. Stop changing pages. You know what? That's not what I want to do. Sorry, I just it just comes out of nowhere for me. Just keep exploring in this direction. Stir and stir and stir. I heard something too. Hold on. Interesting. Ah! I wanted to add that just in case this turns out to be a dud. Crash, 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 crash. Another I don't 
really got anything that goes up in a crazy way. Well. We're on an expedition. going to help me in that direction, so I'm going to head this way. Like, if I had different plants, maybe. But I do not. Good amount of XP. I think I want to ride this portal wherever it ends up taking me. Oh. Okay. Let's chuck it in there then. That's not... whatever. Um... What is free movement back? up so many ingredients on oh, nothing. Both looking kind of good now though. Let's keep going north. Looks like there's a potion to the left of me actually. bail me out. Oh. Yeah, I probably should. Is home down that way. So if I let's say we use this one, let's say we grind it up just a little bit. Oh, that's pretty bad. No, no, no. Oh. right there. Wait, 
going too far. Visibility, hey, all right. Um, I'm gonna get these XP books while I'm up here. XP is good. Oh, that's really bad. Uh... Yeah, no, that's it. That's it, finished potion. I can't recover from that. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's what I was supposed to be doing. Ha <laughs> ha! Oops. So, according to the little dotted lines here, there's one just here. Which could quite possibly be lightning. So let's do a bunch of this again. We'll go up. We'll go right. Go up again. Even though that's going to bring us pretty close to bones. Boins. We'll go right that far. And then we'll reevaluate. Yeah, we'll just go straight up. That's it just there. So we might be able to reach it. If we... Could be a bunch of bones just up here, so I want to be careful. I think. Look at that, that's pretty good. <clears throat> it's not perfect, but it's pretty good. Yeah, we got a two. A two is better than a, than a nothing. Hey, it's lightning too. Alright. Hello. I know I've been gone for what feels like days for you, but I've got a lightning for ya. And I'm gonna haggle the fuck out of you. Because I just wasted a lot of ingredients. Beautiful. Look at my front door stuck. How do I get in my house now? Do you have a solution? I do. As long as you don't you're not worried about having... Ah, I have no penis shrooms. Um. Hey, how about this? But it's... It's a lock that's stuck. If you're strong, you could break the lock. I guess you could blow the door open, but that's a you problem. I don't have the materials to make another explosive potion. 
I mean, I probably could if I'm very careful, but I'm going to use up a whole bunch of shit. Yeah, we got a bunch of lefts and a bunch of ups, and it's just... Be a real dick around to get there, so... Whoa! Hey! What the fuck was that? Don't just throw shit. What the fuck even? What? You just throw stuff out? That's awesome. Don't sort of press B on it here. That just goes back in the inventory. I see how it is. What if I do that? Oh, oh no, sorry. Can't help ya. Hey there, I'm trying to catch a mean fish. Believe it or not, this little thing breathes fire. It melted my whole rod last time. Could you give me a frost potion for my bait? The fish swallows it. Maybe its heat will back off for a bit. Fire breathing fish? And not only. I have all the luck with strange fish. I've got piranha and even a zombie fish once. The fire breathing fish are nothing new to me. Okay. Uh, yeah, this one. Here you go. Um. No. Yes. There you go, bud. Hey, it's you! Hi, Alchemist. Want to replenish your supply of herbs? Oh, also, I have a favor to ask. I could use one of your potions. Oh, what potion do you need? You see, there's this place where I used to gather ingredients, but almost nothing grows there anymore. The plants are growing back oh so slowly. I was wondering if you could make a potion that would make them grow faster. Then I could bring you even more different kinds of herbs. Yeah. Yeah, I got one of them. Here you go. Look at that. Charge your goods. Charge your goods, eh? Um. I have 19, I have 16. 11. I, mean, I do kind of need most of what she's got. That'll do. There you are. I need a potion that can help me enchant an item to make its bearer more nimble and agile. I want a potion with some bonus effects. I'm willing to pay handsomely. Agility potion, eh? Alright. I mean, like... Gonna be agility or dexterity? What's in this one? What's this one? This got bonus effects? I don't need this potion, those effects are incompatible. Nah, they're fine. Cold dexterity? You never heard the saying as cold as a llama? No? Must be regional. Um, how about this one? And one of them as well, I guess. I'll just see. I don't want to give you extra effects, you get fucked. Like, would you have taken dexterity on a own? You buy that for 72. What about this one? What? Man, you suck. I'm gonna haggle with you too. Ugh. Shrooms. Beautiful. I need a freezing potion. Oh, mate. There you go. Buy this potion, but it won't pay very much. I want a potion without side effects. Fucking picky picky. Alright.
you get picky with me, then I'm gonna haggle with you. I want to charge my staff with fire magic. Do you have a potion that will help me? I've never heard of fire before. Is that like a... Is that like some sort of magic? No, obviously not that one. Oops. Alright then. Cockroaches, bed bugs, and other insects. So poison. Not a potion, you're not a poison. How's that for you, bud? Oh, who are you? Um Can I help you today? You need something? Sure you don't need anything? Okay, bye. That was weird. Alright. See ya. Okay. Strange person. all the flowers I need, I need three for I think I'm gonna get one more of these and then I'll start looking at the other stuff but uh, VOD viewers my voice is giving out on me so <clears throat> if you're watching this tomorrow 10 years from now long after I'm gone I hope you've had a very chill day I'm actually gonna turn the music almost all the way down for the next one just a little bit of background noise. Just the tiniest bit there. Yeah, there will do. Um, but yes, if you're watching this tomorrow, 10 years from now, long after I'm gone, you're awesome. And I am sure that you'll hear from me again. Hopefully, I won't be as croaky, but you never know. I'll catch you next time. See ya.